tree in the woods. It's a warm day. <coughs> I have a big skull. Big skull now. Burn my left see. Yeah. Permalip <laughs> over a cigarette. It's more small, very small cigarette. Uh, I couldn't hold it anymore <laughs> because it was too small. Then stuck between my lips was stuck, uh, but I inhaled smoke from it, and suddenly it burned. It gave me a burner on my lip, so I tried. Grab it out, but I accidentally it flipped in my mouth, so I had to puke it out, and and then uh, now all was over. But the burning sensation here on my lip it went extreme, and you see it's a blister, not extreme. I never had extreme pains, luckily not. Also not. Uh, tooth pain. I had one tooth pain in the middle of the night. I couldn't sleep from. So there was only one solution. If I had water in my mouth and the tooth was under water, then I felt no, you know, less pain, less pain. And then the pain was so low that I could fall asleep. So I took the water in my mouth. I went on my side and the water was here. And the uh, cheek and I kept my mouth closed I knew if I fall asleep that the water flows off from my mouth I'm go not going to choke in it it worked I fell asleep those pains stopped tooth pain that's the worst worst pain oh falling from bicycle that's also no I once I was hit by a van that was the worst pain. I was young back then, young. And that was my worst pain. I was, I drove into a traffic post real hard. That also was uh, tremendous pain. Pain symphony. Oh. My hand looked like, because uh, uh, I hit once a window, see this car? That's not this car anymore. Yeah. I have one more beer. Go drink it. I get drunk from one beer. I can get drunk, yes. And I have enough. Drunk? Uh, I don't like to be drunk. I rather have something, uh, something else like speed, wheat. It's better. Both are better. Drunk. It's also not good, eh? But the alcohol it can solve greasy substances in the blood because alcohol is uh, apolar and it solves apolar substances like meat grease from your blood. So it's smart to drink a bottle of wine or two per day to uh, liquefy your blood with alcohol and then it solves the grease molecules from your blood and you uh, urinate them out because this this grease from the meat it goes sticky in your veins suddenly your veins get stuffed up blood is all wrong because there's too much grease in it then you must drink alcohol as much as you can. 
to get your veins open again. And if you use speed, then for sure your veins are open. For sure you can fight against death if you use speed. Then you're stronger than death. My eyes go open. And you say, suddenly you say, wow, I feel good. And that's, then it works. And then you're stronger than death. And you get smarter from it because you feel good. You can think easy. You can say everything. Talk good, I mean. No, then you're stronger than death. If someone is dying on his dying bed, give him speed. And his eyes go open and he can go on living. It's not, then he wins the fight against death. Not people that are uh, all burned up. Yeah, maybe, maybe so, I don't know. But it makes you stronger and puts your veins open. I think it puts your veins open. But you need to continue speed else your veins go closed very much. Because when the speed is all worked out, then the veins go small again. And then it's dangerous. Smaller than small, I think. Smallest. But when speed is working, then your veins are open. Your lungs are open. I can smoke if I use speed. I can smoke without coughing. When speed is all worked out, I start coughing again. See what means this? What does this mean? It helps you breathe better. It fixes your lungs time for, for a certain time. Also that you must uh, consider. All advantages is from speed, you go smarter. I think these people from uh, uh, Down syndrome, I think they are all smart. They are all smart people. And if they use a little speed, a little wit, then they feel real, real, real better. Then they talk better, then they think better. But they are smart, but because of, uh, uh, they think I'm not as smart as others, but they are, they are as smart as others. They are. Just if you uh, answer a lot of questions about reality, like drawing starts, drawing skill. I, I started, I started at the begin drawing. I wasn't good, but year after year you go better it's with everyone. But you need to continue drawing and discovering things. You can also try music. I, one by one you answer questions. And you get answers, and these answers, these are important. The more answers you have, the smarter you are. And if you answer them all, then, then you're smart, smart enough. You have all these answers, you can uh, recall them in your memory, and then you're smart. Suddenly you're smart because you found all answers on all questions. <laughs> oh. So they can also answer questions. They just have to find the right questions and then they need to search the answers. You can use the uh, internet for it, Google and all that. Try figure out atoms. What does what is an atom? Uh, how is it built? What is a molecule? Start with that. And why must there be smallest possible particles like atoms? Smallest. There isn't anything smaller. Why is that? You can answer that question. But you must think a lot. Think very much. And I, like that, I, I did discover there is life after death. I was searching for that answer. That's why I started thinking, writing down. You need a pen and paper, write everything down what you think about. 